I've ordered a Tesla Model S Plaid, but I'm a little bit worried because a lot of people are complaining about its yoke steering wheel. Now, I need to try the car with the yoke before I really do buy it. Unfortunately, the Tesla Model S isn't available in the UK yet. So what I've decided to do is to buy this lovely vintage Mercedes S-Class and what I'm going to do is convert its steering wheel to be like a Tesla yoke. Then I'm going to drive the car through various challenges and obstacles and see if its redesigned steering wheel is enjoyable, ergonomic or just plain excruciating. And if it is, I'm going to cancel my order on the Tesla Model S Plaid. Yes, I'm really going to do this. I am not yoking. <laughs> Anyway, I'm Matt Watson, and you're watching CarWow. Buying a new car? Then head to CarWow, and my team will help you find your next car at a fair price. CarWow, your one-stop car buying comparison site. Right, let's get to this. So, I've got to get this steering wheel, make it look like a yoke. Uh, gonna need to think about safety first, so... Make sure I can be seen. <laughs> Not sure how this helps, but rules. Uh, you gotta protect the old eyes. Although now I can't see. And, right. And now, I think I'm gonna start by making the bottom flat. So, how easy is this gonna be? How tough is the base of that steering wheel? Let's find out. So, oh, right, that's pretty wonderful. Uh, 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 Oh, that's not really working. I need something else. Ah! Oh dear. It's working, it's going flat. Now I need to attack the top. Okay, what am I gonna do? I need to get the, the foam and leather off. Um, oh, I've got an idea. Okay, so look, lighter, deodorant. Don't try this at home. I'm a highly trained professional. We've got safety people here, it's fine. Start doing it. <laughs> Definitely don't ever do that at home, and I'm never doing that again. Uh, I need to try something else. I've got this an electric saw. <laughs> Here we go. Here's Johnny. <laughs> oh, it's running out of battery. Come on! I think I'm going to need a bigger blade. This should do the job. Little pigs, little pigs, let me come in! <laughs> well, here it is. The finished article, my Mercedes yoke. Look at that, it's brilliant. I think I did a fantastic job if I do say so myself. You managed to change the colour slightly. Anyway, let's kick off with the challenges. And the first one is how easy is it to maneuver a car out of a tight parking space? Because for some reason, these two similar age cars have boxed me in. I'm not going to be able to get out with all the wheel twirling when I've only actually got half a steering wheel. I've got all the parking sensors. Do they work? No. I think, I think, <laughs> not very <really> good. <laughs> Wait a minute, I'm going to have to learn new motor skills because obviously my brain's programmed to be able to do it with, I keep on catching my hand on the top. Come on. Nope. I, don't, I think I'm, yeah. There we go, can I get out of there? Is that, no, not quite. Oh, come on. That's really odd when you're looking behind him. That's it, I can get out now. Oh, plumbing it. It's, it. You have to do it one hand. You have to palm it one handed. Right, here we go. We're out. We're out. <laughs> it's like you're playing some kind of Frere Jacques game. <laughs> like when you were a kid. It looks cool though. I can really see the dials. I like that. So, first challenge in, and already I think the yoke is an awful idea. <laughs> Absolutely dreadful. Now I'm going to see what this Mercedes S-Class is like to drive around a city course. How manoeuvrable is it going to be? Here we go. Here comes some twisty lanes here. Oh, I've got to try and stay in lane. Oh! <laughs> 
<laughs> I like holding it when you're in the dead ahead position, but this could be a little bit trickier. I'm doing a lot of holding on the nubbin at the top. Oh, this could be tricky. Like This would be like going around a roundabout. Ow. This is not so good. It's fun doing it to experience it, but is it practical or useful? I'm doing a lot of grabbing of air, but I'm managing to make the maneuvers. Oh, this is hard. Oh, that. I'm, just, I'm just palming the blooming central boss. Oh, this is hard now. Ow, I just hit my hand on this bit. <laughs> just, it's gonna be easy to just steer it like this. <laughs> Elon, this is a bloody stupid idea. It really is. You know, I can see this working on a Formula One car when you don't have much lock. But in a normal car, I can't believe you can't get a normal steering wheel. Look at this on the plaid. <laughs> God. Now, while it's all well and good driving around this closed controlled circuit, what happens when you're out there in the real world where anything can happen? Like at a pedestrian crossing. Ah! Okay, the congestion Yeah, that was a bit shocking. Oh dear. Don't worry everyone, um, I've done a first aid course. Hey, you're gonna be all right. I need to do CPR. Come on. Come on. Actually, it probably shouldn't have blown there. Where's your valve? Oh, there it is. Let's get the valve out. There we go. This will do. This will sort you out. That's it. That's it. There, there, there. You're feeling better now. You're feeling better? Are you all right? No, you crazy. Where, where are you heading? To you mind your own business street. Oh, I'm kind of going that way. Would you, would you like a lift? Yes, you... Oh, looks like you've had a bit of an accident. Don't worry. Come on, I'll give you a lift. You should see my steering wheel, it's really cool. Have a look at this. Great. Watch it. There you are, you're comfy. Nice. Shut up and drive. <sighs> yeah, this yoke isn't ideal when you're having to make an emergency maneuver. Isn't that right? You, you, you should probably strap yourself in. You don't want to have another accident. Come on. It was your fault. Come on. That's it. Any time today. There you are. We're good to go. Get off. So, what do you think of the steering wheel? It's a little bit weird, isn't it? It's an ergonomic disaster. Now, according to Elon Musk, this is a brilliant idea, but I'm not so sure. So I'm going to try some various tests with it, see what it's like to live with and drive. By the way, what's your name? My name is Barbara. Oh, nice to meet you, Barbara. I'm Matt. How do you do? Don't go thinking we are friends. I'm still suing you. Should we go a bit quicker? You don't mind, dear. You? Your driving is frightening me. Do you know what? On this kind of route, when I'm not having to turn the steering wheel too much, well, oh, I'm now. <laughs> Spoke too soon there. It's generally okay. But if something happened and I had to do a, an urgent correction, I'm not sure how much I'd like to be dealing with this. I mean, that's part of the reason why we had our little accident earlier. I'm not going to accept responsibility. It was a both party at fault situation, I think you'll find. You'll be hearing from my lawyer soon. People who like to drive with their hand on top of the wheel won't like it so much, but I guess you can just drive like that. Hmm, so that was okay, but I think we need to try another test. You up for that, Barbara? I really need to go to hospital. What I'm going to do now is see how easy it is to drive this car through quite a tight slalom course. It won't take very long. I have a life, you know. I have places to be, like the hospital. Would we'll you get this done and, and then I'll take you, okay? Hospital, now. Come on, this is science. We need to do this. We need to ascertain whether the yoke is a good idea or not. Help me, somebody. Oh, no, this is, no, this is just, I'm absolutely just... <laughs> I'm not hardly, uh, I could catch my hand a lot on the on the top bits here. This is so hard. What do you think, Barbara? You're sh Would you be able to drive like this? Better than you. No, well, I'm struggling myself and I'm supposedly semi-pro. I'd say you were more of a semi <laughs> than a pro. Oh, God, look at that. I'm just, I'm all over the place. <laughs> 
<laughs> now I'm getting to a rhythm with it. Oh, no, but then it catches me out again. Oh, right. Are you all right? I'm worried sick. See, I'm feeling a bit sick as well. Oh, oh. I wonder if something else might make you feel a little bit more sick, but I think it might impress you. Please let me go. So what I want to do is impress Barbara with my car handling skills. Do you fancy a bit of drifting? I think I'm losing consciousness. Please call a doctor. Yeah, you do. Come on. It's fun. Your driving is terrible. Ah, we can do it anyway. You'll like it. Yeah, you ready? Oh, it's, uh, nothing to grab onto there. It makes it harder. Oh, now I'm all about the understeer. Oh, Babs. Oh, look at this. Oh, oh right. Let's try the other way. Oh. My leg is broken. Keep my, I'm keeping my foot in, Babs. I need treatment, you moron. Oh, yeah, I've got it now. If you find the right spot, it's okay. Transition it. Could be harder. It's all the wheel's fault. It's nothing to do with me. You talk so much. See, it's hard. Look, I've got nothing to hold on to there. Oh, look at that, Barbara. How hot does that make me appear? Yeah? I think I'm bleeding out, you idiot. So then, what's my final verdict of having a yoke rather than a normal round steering wheel? Well, there is a reason why I've removed the yoke from this car and put the normal wheel back in, and that's because driving with a yoke is just a little bit harder. So with that in mind, should I cancel my order for that Tesla Model S Plaid? Hello, Barbara. You all right? Yes, apart from a fractured femur. What do you reckon? Should I cancel my Model S plaid order? Just buy the Tesla. Now take me to the hospital. Well, if Barbara thinks I should still buy the car, then I bloody well will. <laughs>